Welcome to Let's Play Forza Motorsport 2 Part 25. In this segment, I'm going to buy a car, because I kind of need to. So, we're going to go over here to Mitsubishi, and uh, I'm going to buy this Eclipse GT. Because, yeah. Man, this thing looks weird. Like, the more I look at this, the more I don't like it. <laughs> Especially compared to the previous Gen Eclipse, but... It's kind of not nearly as good, so... Let's just get this. Get it in orange, because orange looks pretty cool on it. And, uh, yeah. So, here's the car we're going to be using for this segment. To the rivalry face-offs and the second events, which is the Sport Compact Shootout, Celica versus Eclipse. So... Here's the opponent list. Sasaki is driving the prize car. Surprise, surprise. Always gotta have the lead car be the fucking car you win from this. But anyways. So, we're going to Road Atlanta short. First time we've been to Road Atlanta in a while. And Silverstone and Sakuba. Alright. Well, let's go. Alright, here we go. I am starting in fourth place. Because there are three Eclipse GTs in this. Very good. All right, well, let's go. Let's go and hope for the best, because that Celica, although it is much higher uh, PI, I don't think it's going to have much of a straight line advantage, because I think it's mostly, uh, most of its performance advantage is going to be in handling. Oh, hey. Oh, hey, Charlotte made a new account. Whoa. So, yeah. I have some issues uh, with getting like epic runs through turns, although that helped. Alt account alert. I don't know. Can okay, actually doing pretty good. Ooh, I like that livery. Oh, like with the tearing away to blueprint. That looks cool. I like that. Oh, holy shit, I actually outbroke Sasaki. Okay. Well then. <clears throat> oh, fuck. How you doing, car? Alright. Man, that fucking Salico looks menacing. Especially c compared to my bubble that is this Eclipse. <clears throat> this thing is just a big giant fucking bubble. And stuff. Fifth gear short as fuck. I wasn't even paying attention to it. Oh, yep, that fifth gear is very short. Okay. Nice fifth gear game. Reminds me of that, uh, that one Volkswagen in Forza 1 that has the, uh, I think fifth gear that, I think when you upshift, you only, it only drops like 500 RPM, if that. Very similar to that. It was Sasaki going for a dive. He was thinking about it. Turn 10 hasn't updated this track. Hmm, sounds like a polyphony. With uh, Daytona and Indianapolis. I can't believe polyphony, like, when they added Daytona and GT5, they put in the fucking old bus stop. Like, dude, Kaz. Y you do know they don't do that bus stop anymore, right? Right? You know? Okay? Yeah, alright. Oh, fuck. Suddenly, random back pain. Ow. Which is not more of a pain, it's like one of those painful itches. But, yeah. 
In his final lap, I have a second point six over Sasaki. And then we have a, a lot over Takahashi and Yoshida and everyone else. He missed the bus. Oh fuck. Yeah, he missed the bus. That's why he went on the longer the longer bus stop. Uh, uh, anyways. So there went my 1.6 second lead. Whoops. Jeez, Kaz, why you gotta be late for the bus? I just gotta figure out what his excuse is for not, uh, changing the, uh, the hairpin section at Indianapolis to what it is now. Hmm, Cass, anyways. Now CQ's having a field day with these better titch emotes. And there we go, race one complete, alright. So this isn't going to be very difficult, I don't think. So like I said, Sasaki Soka isn't really got the straight line advantage, it just has a uh, handling and braking advantage, so... I just gotta, uh, be aware about how I take my turns and shit, so it shouldn't be too bad. So there we go. Race one complete. I just realized I got 7,000 credits for, uh, initial prize for winning. Nice. So let's go to race two. Alright, so, uh, it's now on attempt three here, and you notice I'm starting second, and also I gained 70 PI. That's because I, uh, put sport weight reduction on this thing. Took 300 pounds off of it to try to compete with Sasaki. So, um. Yeah. Because, uh, remember how I said that Celica is very superior when it comes to handling compared to this car? I wasn't bullshitting. It's very superior. So, I spent like, what, 2,000 credits on that? Weight reduction? Which is pretty fucking cheap. And let's put it to not good use because I just kind of botched that turn. So I wonder I wonder, I, wonder, I wonder how like improvement in performance I'll get here with this just 300 less pounds in the car. I even better. This is going to be where Sasaki's at his strongest in this uh, section. This is where he's going to gain, like, have the best chance at uh, getting around me, probably. Okay. Slow way down. 95 miles per hour, yay! Yeah, I'm holding the lead, so that's good. Game complete. Oh boy! People give me money hype for some reason. Oh no, I have botched this turn again, and Sasaki's trying to take advantage. Anyways, thank you, Charlotte. Oh, Sasaki with the dive again. Damn. Getting some glod. Heck yeah, fam. Sh stop saying fam me. Holy fuck. I need to stop this right now before it actually becomes a thing. It's like right now. It's time to stop. Charlotte's not the sellout, dude. It's just uh, the sellout enabler. I don't know. Hey, I ran a 105. Something I couldn't do with uh, the 300 extra pounds. Cool. Granted, I think my best lap in that for in that well second attempt actually, because the first attempt was just a fucking massive failure. But um, I think my best lap was what like a 106.003 or something like that. I don't know. Point is, I'm improved. Uh, the weight reduction helped. 
Plus, the, uh, the better grid position also immensely helps. Honestly, the biggest contributor to uh, me having the lead right now is the fact I'm starting two places higher on the grid instead of... Because, yeah. It means I don't have to deal with Takahashi and Yoshida. I just go straight for Sasaki. Sell out with me, oh yeah. Sell out with me tonight. And there's a 105.7, alright. Sweet. Still slower than what Sasaki's could get capable of. Sasaki. Like, just saying Sasaki's name is giving me a stutter. Help. Because I was about to say what Sasaki's could capable of. And the fact that capable is kind of like, ba 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 ba. Help me. <laughs> English is hard, man. Sasaki isn't even an English name. Shut up, man. The people in the titch are gonna give me lots of money and everything's gonna be alright. Anyways. Final lap time. Oh, there's a 5-2. Holy shit. That was faster than Sasaki's ever run. So I think his best lap in the uh, last attempt was a uh, 5-4? Something like that. Got a few links on him. So, plenty of breathing room here. exploding myself. Are we talking like, Gary, you're gonna finish your dessert and you're gonna like it explode, or like, bomb inside a pie explode? Two very different... Yeah. Shut up, man. Hey, I won the race. Sweet. Only took a couple tries and, uh, no weight reduction, but yeah. I did it. You should be able to have better titch settings like thing on Firefox. I don't know. I honestly don't see uh Yeah. What makes Firefox ver what would make the Firefox version so much different? I don't fucking know. I don't know anything about this technical shit. I'm gonna shut the fuck up and just uh do a jump cut to the fucking last race. Okay, okay. Okay, well, um, maybe if I don't fuck up, I'll actually win this race. But the key is to not fuck up. Alright, so I have a uh, strat here for the start of the race. I'm going to go underneath Sasaki here instead of trying to go, just go around the outside in turn one. So I can have bottom lane here, try to do something. It didn't work. I'm not actually the pl if I don't have anything going on tomorrow, I'll be streaming at the uh, like the afternoon time, the my day off. I'm streaming on my day off time basically. But if I do have plans, fucking I don't know when I'm gonna stream. Now get the fucking behind me, Sasaki, and stay the fuck behind me. Holy shit, car please. Wobbling all over the place. All right. Stop spinning the damn wheels. I'm sorry. I'll stop spinning the wheels if you stop failing to moat, like to post a moat's queue. All right. Do we have an agreement here? It's okay. I didn't fail the retard dive this time. I just have to uh hit my marks and not go super wide and pretty much op leave the door wide open for Sasaki like I'm almost currently doing 
Almost. Listen, bitch. No, you listen. I don't give a shit how new these emotes are. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Oh, please make it. Okay, we made it. A good exit. Lots of wheel spin, but we got an exit. Then I jazz with the failed emote. GG. You know, you guys have better tish. You know what you guys would really benefit from? Having using the uh like emote menu. I have fucked this turn up immensely. Also another thing you guys can do is uh Start typing the emote and then press tab and if and hopefully have a uh, titch like the thing filled out the rest of the uh, command for you. Bear titch and most aren't in the menu. You're looking in the wrong menu. There's like a different emote menu for a better Twitch. I don't know if you have to like enable it in the settings, but yeah. Oh god. Okay, two laps to go. Just have to hold off Sasaki for two more laps. I'm surprised how close Takahashi and Yoshida are to us. To be honest. Cause like they're right there. Yeah, Rally Arts Mitsubishi's tuning division. Oh, oh no! How you doing, Sasaki? Okie dokie. Key. Not Q. Key. G fucking G. Fucking G. I am really bad at driving this car around this fucking track. Holy shit. Like, really bad. Oh, he's going for the inside dive. I'm going to block him. Oh, he swung out wide, you motherfucker. He bamboozled me. No, you don't. I have no idea if rally art's still a thing, to be honest. We've been struggling with this turn, these last two turns with this car. So uh, let's try to get these turns proper here. Okay, see you double A. And there we go. Got him. Got him. Ah, uh, just over five minutes. Damn. Didn't get that sub five minute race. Oh well. And there we go, everyone across the line. Sweet. Hey, we've reached level 22. I've reached yawn level fuck. And hey, I, find I got my first car to level 3. Nice. So, I've unlocked 12 cylinder Ferraris in the dealer shit. Okay. And we got some intercooler discount now. Cool. Cool. Oh, I'm actually surprised at how uh, good the AI is in this game, as far as like awareness to you. It's pretty damn good. Like I don't remember it being this good. It's some good shit, man. Anyways, we finally get we get the epic time attack car that Sasaki was kicking my ass with. Yay! I like this car. It looks really nice. Like I said, I like that livery. So, there we go. So, uh, there's the level 10 uh, fucking rivalry face-offs done. I think that's all the level 10 events done. Yep, because these are level 15. So, I guess next time before the 2, we'll start the level 15 events. Stay tuned for that.